And welcome back to Daybreak. There, wait a second. That's not us. <laughs> we are joined by Sharon Skates right now in our studio. She makes custom cakes here in the Valley. This is one of them. I'm going to be completely honest. It's one of the coolest things I've ever Thank seen. You. I've never seen myself on a cake. I'm dying <laughs> to know how you made this. Uh, just, you know, playing with fondant, like playing with Play-Doh, okay, just edible. Okay, cool. Yeah. And it, it, this is, all of it is edible? Yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. Yep, and right. today you're going to tell us how to smooth out a cake? Well, right? yeah, I'm just going to show you a really simple way. Um, if you use a buttercream that is um, usually 50-50 butter and shortening, um, not the store-bought icing, that won't work. You can use a simple Viva paper towel to actually um, smooth it. You ice the cake, let it sit for like 5-10 minutes, it gets a sort of a... a a crust to it so that when you touch it it doesn't come back and then when you take a, a Viva paper towel because it doesn't have any texture to it you see mm -hmm. it, it smooth it actually smooths out the cake for you so that's how you get a cake nice and smooth like that I look at how clean the paper towel is yeah it doesn't come off actually people I've heard use copy paper as well there's different techniques out there but um, this is what I use of course now, how long have you been making cakes like these? Because I can only imagine me making this cake right here. I'm sure it wouldn't look anywhere close to that. I but. started when my son was three. He's ten now. Just making my kids' birthday cakes. I have three little ones, and every year I just get bigger and better. Okay, very, very <laughs> cool. So, once again, what's in this uh, this frosting that you made right here? Um, it's a 50-50 butter and shortening frosting. Powdered sugar, butter, shortening. It's a really simple recipe. Um, there's lots out there, but... Okay, okay. And uh, you'd also like to tell us about your Facebook page, correct? Oh, well, yeah, you can find me on uh, Custom Cakes by Sharon. Um, just search for that on Facebook and you'll find me. Okay, and now what are you adding right now? I'm just piping on a little border. Um, you know, you can, for Halloween, um, if you want to make some fondant spiders or bats or something to top it off with, or even um, you can find, this is a gummy. Mm -hmm. Different places sell these things around the holidays. You know, that is you a can, big, that's probably the biggest yeah. gummy worm I think I've ever seen. But that's, <laughs> yeah. I love Just something you warm. can do at home, you know? <laughs> very cool. You see this cake right here, and you see the Daybreak one right here. Very, very cool stuff, Sharon. Thank you very much thank for coming you. into our thank studio. You. But Daybreak continues now with our Bunny Scope